oil prices steadied around $100 after steep losses in the previous two seasons, as investors returned to their focus to tight supply even as fears of a global recession persisted. Brent and WTI closed on yesterday at their lowest since April 11, following a dramatic fall on Tuesday. Boris Johnson is to resign as Conservative Party leader today as dozens of government ministers resigned in protest at Johnson's perceived lack of integrity and a confused policy course. Johnson intends to stay on as Prime Minister until autumn. Benchmark UK government bond deals rose amid speculation that whoever replaces Johnson will seek to cut taxes in an effort to shore up the party's popularity ratings. Rivian Automotive announced that it produced 4,401 vehicles in the second quarter as its manufacturing facility in Normal, Illinois, and delivered 4,467 vehicles during the same period. Shares of Rivian Automotive rose 12% after the electric vehicle maker announced that it is on track to produce 25,000 vehicles this year. Amazon's deal to offer meal delivery service Grubhub for free to prime customers for a year is weighing on the shares of rival food delivery companies, including Uber Technologies down 3.5% and DoorDash down 7.6%. As Philip Capital team, we wish you happy and healthy days.